Happy first day of fall. It is. And it's actually nice and cool here today. It is. It's very fall-like. It was actually and nice and... Tomorrow it'll be hot again. Yeah, L.A. Hey, welcome back to our stupid Rex with Corbin. I'm Rick. You can follow us on Instagram and Twitter for more juicy content. Thank you to everybody who supports on Patreon. Follow us through the comment, subscribe, like button. Yeah. Why don't you do that? Today we're doing a movie review of the film that just came out, the 2023 film, John A. John, or how they put it on the American Netflix, Special X. Dun, dun, dun. That's what it was, right? Special X? Is what yeah. Did? Uh, uh, no, uh, Suspect X. Suspect X. Suspect X. That's right. Um... I don't like it when they change the uh, title to English. I know. <laughs> like, just put it. Just put the title there. Like, it's really okay. I know it's not English. So just... But I think the reason Shajoy did that is because it's from a book of a different title yeah. as well. And that gives anybody who knows the book title that name. Does the but, book title but, mean uh, Suspect X? I think the original book title means that, but it also means like The Beloved, something like Anyways. that. Anyway. Uh, directed by a Bondu. Yep. Uh, Sujoy Ghosh. We've slept in the same bed. <laughs> uh, written by him as well in terms of adaption from the uh, original Japanese novel. And if you don't know what I mean by that, it's because we, we've stayed in the same room at the same hotel. Not at the same time. Let me clarify. Not at the uh, same time. I did that with Michael Jackson. Produced by him as well. <laughs> That's uh, true. And also, uh, Dost on Dose Crimes. In the yes. Of Jai Deep and Vijay Varma. And a future. Also, future Dost in hopefully. Karina Kapoor. Exactly. I uh, would love to uh, be able to talk to her. Yeah, but, we've got... A bundu and two dosts. Yeah. T tell her tell her that coming over here was fun. Yeah, it's a great time. Yeah. Uh, anyways. We've got Old Monk. It's uh, on Netflix right now. Uh, just came out yesterday. Um, so if you haven't watched it, please go watch it. We'll start with uh, non-spoilers and then yeah. we'll get into some spoils before we uh, spoil your butt. Yep. Um, so, uh, Rick, your initial non-spoiler thoughts, please. Watch it. <laughs> um. For all the reasons you should and we thought you would want to watch it from the trailer, the fact that it's written and directed by Sujoy Ghosh, if you like the films that I think, I think you would agree with me, the kinds of films that are really in his wheelhouse that he's really, really good at is this mm -hmm. kind of a film. Mm -hmm. If you like the acting of Vijay Varma and Jai Deep and Karina Kapoor, you're going to enjoy the acting of Jai Deep, Vijay Varma, yep. and Karina Kapoor. And... Just uh, the only thing I would say is allow it to just unfold before your eyes. Just this is one of those movies that you get to just sit back and enjoy in the same way that right before a, a, a if you've gone on a roller coaster before, especially one that you don't know, the incline as you're beginning can feel a lot longer than you were <clears throat> expecting because you don't know when that's going to finally go. Or what's over the edge, yeah. Enjoy the and enjoy the incline. Yeah, and I I I really enjoyed it. I'd watch it again. Yeah, I did as well. It's a uh, enjoyable uh, entertainer that yep. at, even for a two hour twenty film, it didn't drag at all. Yeah, you I know. was I was a little concerned with the runtime. Yeah. I thought at some point I was going to not like the runtime. Yeah, yeah, uh, it didn't drag. Not at all. It definitely kept you intrigued the entire time. A lot of that has to do with obviously the writing. A lot of it has to do with the performance, the acting uh, from all of our uh, Bondu dosts. Um, but it was a, a incredibly fun, entertaining, um, not one that quirky I, I, at I, times. I, yeah, too. I, I wouldn't call it edge of your seat thriller, uh, but it's a definitely entertaining thriller. Yeah, it's this is not a spoiler, but just so that you would be prepared, because if you're not prepared, I think it might you might be a little disappointed if you went in with a certain expectation. Don't go into it with the expectation of it having the pacing of, say, Badla. The pacing's very, very different. Yeah. The intrigue is the same, the same, but the pacing is very different, and it 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 ought to be allowed to be the pacing it has. Yeah. I, I liked the pace. Yeah, I did as well. It, it was definitely a very, and it kept you guessing about Correct. Um, what was going to happen well, next or or why. Um, that's just, I mean, that if you know Sujoy Ghosh and you've seen any of his, and I haven't read films, the original material either. Neither have I. But and if you see the trailer, you're anticipating, you're going to be wondering. Is what I'm seeing really what I'm seeing? Yeah. So yep. if you've if you've read the obviously the novel or anything like that, please let us know how it, how it 
held up right. to the uh, original material. We're just printing right. it off of what we saw. Yep. Um, but I, I definitely think it's a worthy watch. I don't think I need to go into any more spoiler talk, uh, non-spoiler talk about no. that. Um, yep. I, I think it's just a worthy watch, and you should go watch it. And then Agreed. come back, and we'll, we'll we'll get into some more spoils about yeah. everything else. It's just since it's like a thriller, you don't want to really give anything away. Um, at all. At it's, all. It it's is just, it's absolutely an entertaining an thriller. Entertaining thriller yeah. That I think for sure. You would not, you'd ha have to have a certain maturity, so biological age isn't the way to measure this. But if you're thinking about who in the family can watch it, I, kids would be, just be bored. They wouldn't understand what is going on. Teenagers would probably, depending upon the maturity of your teenager, would be really intrigued by yeah. this. So I yeah. think from like 13 and up, probably as a ballpark, you could watch it. But for the most part, this is probably one of those things where you would enjoy with your significant other. Oh yeah, a nice little you know glass of wine or some and something, and just turn the lights off and enjoy the uh, the drama. That's what I did. Yep. Uh, anyway, so go watch it. We're going to get into the spoils now and more in-depth about uh, everything. So yes. if you haven't watched, please go watch it on Netflix. Come back. Yes, okay. this is for everyone who has seen it. When Karina... <laughs> no. Um, let's talk about the performances. Yes, uh, Because they're... Um, and my favorite, I don't know about who your favorite, and I liked all of them. I think they all did so, so well. Jaideep, though... Uh, was the, the... Was he your favorite? He was my favorite performer. Yeah, I have a favorite, but he, it's not, it's not Jaideep. Was, one different than everything else we've seen him. I love yeah. I love his versatility because at first when I think the first thing we saw him in was um the series. Um was it Patal Lock? No, he wasn't Patal Lock. It was um was it Patal Lock? What was the series we saw him in? Yeah, I Why am I forgetting the series? I think it it is. It's Patal Lock? I think so. Yes. Yes, it is. Patal Lock. I was correct. Yes. Um you know, one, we would have loved his performance in that, and he was yeah. great. But um, I don't think from that I would have thought you're a versatile actor. You're just you're just really good. And I actually think from what, everything I've seen of him now, the more stuff, I'm like, I actually think he's a very versatile actor. Oh, he is. And can do a lot. He can. Um, and this performance was um, very nuanced. It was different than everything else I've seen of his. It was um, restrained at times. And then... Um, uh, he just showed a lot of range in this one that I, that yeah. I really, really appreciated. What do you think was the performance? I agree. I put, I put, for me, the 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 artistry level and the kinds of roles and films that they do is is. Um, you could play this role for sure. Jide I, yeah, I'd love to. It's a it it, it very I mean, interesting and intriguing. Long. You could very <laughs> interesting. Um, um, I was just forgetting the name I was going to reference, but that's okay. Jaideep. Yeah, it was Jaideep, but he, it was there was another actor um, okay. I was going to reference that they do similar roles and they have a similar depth and a similar capacity. And anytime we see him now in something, because we've seen enough of his work, we know that what you're going to get yes. is is going to be solid. And it 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 absolutely was. Yeah. He's, um, I mean, what do you? It, any there's just the actors that when you hand them the roles you know they're going to do a solid job. All three of these are actors that if you're doing something and they're right for that role, you know they're going to give you a solid performance, and that's exactly what happened. As well with, as the, uh, her husband. Yeah, who we, we've, we've seen, seen a, a lot. On. I think he, he does, he does a gazillion work. supporting roles. Yeah. Just like, he's probably done a thousand, a thousand uh, uh, supporting roles, and especially he's done stuff in series that we've seen. Um, he he had a, a supporting role in Mirzapur, um, and uh, uh, it's him, right? Yeah, we just saw him in Hadi as well. Yeah, in Hadi. Uh, yeah, he's okay. just he's in a ton of stuff, and he does great work all the time. He does. Um, anyway, who was your favorite? Was it Karina? Karina. Yeah, yeah. The reason being, uh, so we've seen her in a ton of stuff, uh -huh. like ten yeah. films. We've really seen a lot of Karina Kapoor. Not enough. There's still more to see. But in the scope of, of her work, and I, I did some researching as well, because and the reason I did it was because, and I'm, I'm happy to find out what I did in regard to she has made a conscious decision. And this film is one of the very first, this film and one other one that's going to come out is the beginning of a new season of work for her intentionally that I read, where she's made a decision to, I wrote it down, that the, this new phase for her is to focus on artistic merit rather than stardom. Mm. Uh, first of all, yes, always and forever. Focus on the artistic merit more than stardom. Which she admittedly says that she began doing the work because of the, the pay. Yeah, of course. I, I mean, but she's 
and we've seen this from her before. I remember that I think the very first time I was impressed with her as an actress was Omkara. That and then uh um not that I didn't enjoy her silliness, for example, as like poo, although I did have to laugh. The minute they said Sonia at the beginning of the film, I, I laughed out loud. Yeah. I thought that was really funny. Um, um I think but Talosh with Amira yes, as well. Yes, She was, was very good that in that. We, but I think we I think the first time we saw her in something that wasn't the standard commercial film was Omkara. Three Idiots. That's that was the first thing. Yeah. yeah and she was, was great in Three Idiots. That was the first thing. That was the first thing we ever saw her in. Yeah. But the first thing was like to, to yeah. coin the phrase of flexing the thespianatic muscle, yeah. it was Omkara, I believe, yeah, for me. Probably. She was giving me, and I mean this not in the form of that she was impersonating. I mean this in terms of complimenting her as an actress. She had a emotional availability. It could have been Uda Punjab as well. Sorry. That too. Uh, and she had an emotional availability. Mm. She had a believability. It was actually so much. And she had <gasps> a strength in her persona that is that was reminiscent to me of how I feel when I watch Taboo. Mm. And if this is the beginning point of you focusing on the artistry. I don't even beautiful. I mean, because I, I am so excited to see what more of her work is going to be because I she she carried for me the same level of capacity. And I mean, we're talking about Taboo, who for me is one of the greatest actresses to ever be put on film. Mm. Um, I, I this I felt I just thought she was absolutely beautiful in every frame of film on this. Yeah, she um she's super interesting because and i loved her performance as well i thought it was it was great and we've seen it a lot um because a re like at first you'd think since we have seen her in a lot of commercial stuff even though she's so good and everything but like if you just if i think of Karina kapoor i think of poo like, yeah the first and she's thing that comes so to mind. fun and sexy in those things because it's iconic absolutely and but it's I, it, was, it was of the time it right was, it was karen johar of the time so it was right. extremely over the top that was right. what the character was supposed to be right so she did it extremely well right and so that's the first thing that comes to my mind. And so I have to readjust my mind to think of, we've seen her actually more in the other side because I just went over an IMDb here. She has so many great performances. Oh, she does. Yeah, Lalsing, I've got a... Lalsing Chada. Lalsing, Lalsing Chada, don't even get me started. Yeah. Uh, Uda Punjab, Baji Bajan with, with Salman Khan yep. in it. Uh, uh, Talash. Yeah. Uh, Talash, we, lo we loved her in. She was great Obviously, in. did you mention Uda Punjab? Yeah, Uda Punjab. Yep. Three Idiots, which yep. even though it's commercial, she was... It was Omkara. Uh, yeah. Uh, so there's so many that And are, by the way... Happy happy belated birthday, Bebo. Yeah. It was yesterday. Uh, Omkara. And, and then, Day before by the time you see this. She was in Dawn. And happy anniversary in advance because she and Safe have an anniversary in October. <laughs> and uh, Jab, we met as well. Yeah. Uh, but those were like that, I said, that's more, seen commercial. more commercial. But we've actually seen more of her actually, I think, in the the better role in terms of like the the acting wise it's just hard to because like you said the first thing i think of when i think of green Port, of is course poo. i think of poo every single time of course and so i'm like that's that's just who she is and actually i think she's actually the other i think she's actually more an actress that is just she's really good at the commercial stuff as well <laughs> she is but i'm i'm i believe and i'm rooting for her i see in her a depth and a capacity in acting and I believe, based on what I've, you know, what I read about Bimbo. what she's really focusing on is that she's she is now going to be entering into what is the beginning of the wheelhouse of really doing some spectacular, uh, uh, meritorious. I was going to say award winning, but that doesn't mean anything most places anymore. Um, meritorious kinds of performances that I'm so looking forward to. We saw it in in La Sing Chada and the reasons for that not being well received are so absurdly ridiculous because the quality of that from every level is is especially her performance yeah. and the script yeah. by Kunkarni. Um, um I, but I just you love what her. she's doing next though, right? Uh re refresh my memory the because crew. I did see it. The what? The crew, which is um a uh it has Karina Rajkumar. Creedy, oh yes, yes, Creedy Sun and Taboo. Taboo. Yeah, and Diljit. Diljit. I was wondering, has, has it has that? It's the last time she worked with Diljit, Uda Punjab. Might be. Ah, oh. because uh, he does obviously he's more of a yeah. A but performer. the great thing is to know that more than likely, if you see her name attached to something right now, her focus is on artistic merit, not stardom. 
uh, uh, which is always preferred. Uh, uh, choose to be an actor, not a movie star at the end of the day. She got Karen Johar, a director, coming up here too. Ali Abad. Oh, it's... Whoa. Look at this. Look at this cast. Look at this cast. Ranveer, Karina Kapoor Khan, Ali Abad, Vicky Koshal, Bhumi <laughs> Pednikar, <laughs> and Anil Kapoor and Tanvi Kapoor. Oh, my and stars. Tucked, which I think I've heard stuff about. I think it's been in production for a long time. But it's Karen Johar. Um, okay, so hold on. I was just reading the log line a little bit. Is this like what we've been waiting for? Karen Johar embracing and doing a story that is very much artistic, historical drama, not his wheelhouse of the the Bollywood love that he he has done for years, but we've often said we want to see him do more. Well, even if it's really serious even stuff. Even if it's not, having that cast is going to elevate it to a, a level that um cuz all those actors are actors that we absolutely Heck yes. adore. There's yeah. not one they're all bad, heavyweights. Yeah, they're all heavyweight actors. Yeah. So I don't know what this is you guys could tell us. Um but anyway, let's, let's get back to the film. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. We get off the tangent Karina Kapoor, you're amazing. Uh would love to have you on the channel. Yeah, would love to talk to you. Um another, the other dose and is, your husband. Come yes, both of you join us. VJ Varma. Yeah. Uh which oh, you know we love. I, I think he's one of the best young actors. Even Agreed. I don't think he's that young. He's probably older than I am actually. No, but he is um, young in the consciousness of the audience, I yes. believe. Um but he gave a different he has such versatility. So mm -hmm. it's like the first things you see him in, I think he was people were trying to put him in the Nawaz roles. Uh of like right. put a gun in his hand, right? Which right. he can do and he does amazing. Yeah. But I think he's on purpose, trying to do these different roles to show I have this range and I don't want to be put in a box. And yeah. Also, I'm such, I like to do these different roles. I can do these different roles. Mm -hmm. The being the the cop, uh, which also had different variants to him of his attraction to Karina Kapoor at the same time. Yep. Uh, and he gave, had such depth and such chemistry and such, like, I I loved his performance. I, yeah, I think my, it was a, a great performance. My him. favorite thing about his role is I feel like I spent more time watching him think than talk. Yeah. Even though he had a ton of dialogue, I really felt like the majority of the time, if of those three characters, if there was one of them, and that makes sense because he's the one trying to figure things out, um, it, it requires a certain depth of actor to be able to play that character without indicating or stereotyping what they're doing. And yeah, I... We knew it from the, tra really knew it from the trailer. If you've got these actors in something, and all the supporting were great as well. So hats off to um, Sujoy Josh Gosh. Sorry, of um, um, I don't. It's usually always. I think the only issues we had with his directing ever were in the short that we saw in Lust Stories too, and but it was the performances weren't bad. No, <laughs> I think he's a really good. No, director it was at just directing. It was uh, actors uh, agreed, and obviously when he's in his wheelhouse, he always tries to do stuff different with story and and keep the audience guessing, which and, is, is, is wonderful. And it does seem that this is he's very good at thrillers, yes, he is, whodunits mm -hmm. in every way. I mean, there were several points in this I was thinking he makes it look so easy with his screenwriting and his directing. This kind of film is not easy to pull off. Um, because you can show too much, not show enough. Yeah. I mean, of all genres, this is one that's really, really difficult because you, you can't make mistakes with what you show people in either direction because then you, you ruin the illusions. Yeah. Which I loved the through. He does this so many times where he lets you know in the script. I'm playing tricks on you. Yeah. Pay attention to me. Yep. He does it in the script. Yeah. And he it was paid attention. Yeah. The little thing, the, two, the, you know, the little thing with the coin with the student and then his statements in mathematics. Um, he's just such an intelligent writer and storyteller. And this is my favorite. I, I have seen Badla now probably five or six times just because it, it especially watching it with somebody who hasn't seen it because you love watching where they're guessing and if they're coming close to understanding what's going on. And at one point, Did you say again, this is your favorite uh, um, film of his? No, no, no. That uh, Badla is, if I said it was my favorite, it's one of my favorites. I love watching Badla over and over again. Okay. But my, the, there was a point because Kahani was super where the, the, yeah, I love Kahani. <laughs> the ascent I was talking about in the intro gotcha. of this there was a point where I was waiting for that to come over and 
it wasn't happening. And I even wrote in my notes at that point when I was wondering, when are, where are we going with yeah. this? And I said, I wish I hadn't known what happened the way V like VJ, I, I wish I had been in his mindset, not knowing what I, because he showed us what happened. Yeah. And then I pulled myself back from that and said, no, 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 no. I think I've seen, I know Sujoy Ghosh. Yeah. He's going to trick. And sure enough, the minute it tipped over the edge, the rest of the finality of the film was just. Um, <laughs> the one, one of the issues, and maybe you guys can tell me why this would happen. I don't, I actually don't understand why they didn't go to the police in the first place. Because when and her I, husband I know, showed up. Yeah, yeah. And he was basically attacking and saying he was going to sell his daughter into prostitution. Because he's a cop. Um, so you think they would, wouldn't believe it was because he's a cop? His word against theirs. But he's dead now. So. Oh, you mean after they killed him? Yes. So like, it's just because they killed a cop. But they, there's two of them. They could say he he attacked us. He was saying he was going to sell us into um, prostitution. Obviously, I know there's different laws. This is Nepal, uh, so different l rules that would be here. Because like, right. all they would have to do is like a mother and daughter would have to say he he was attacking us. We were acting in self defense. Um, and so I don't I didn't understand why they couldn't have done that. Mm, that didn't dawn on me. So you or guys bother can, me. me and my wife were just running. I, like, I don't I don't understand why you just didn't go to the police. Um, and maybe there's a reason. And I, I'm, I'm open to knowing. And it didn't ruin the film well, for part, me. Part of that would be. I, I just, mean, I always assume there's just laws and stuff in other countries that I just don't. Yeah. Know. But at that point, it would be prove it. Because what evidence would they be able to prove that he did anything? He had only been there a day. Well, There's no physical marks on anybody that he assaulted them. That's true. Um, I, My thought would just be there's two of them. And so you have witness and, and other stuff. Um, maybe I'm wrong. You guys let me, please let me know. It didn't ruin the film at all. I, I really enjoyed this film. I just, that was the one thing that it kept going in my mind. I was like, I just don't understand why you just didn't go to the police. To, it didn't make sense to me. Um, <laughs> uh, but uh, you guys, please. Once nice again, score, let me by know. the way. Uh, yes, I did really enjoy the score. Yeah, really um, well done. It's, and there was, I kept trying to figure out, because right when, <laughs> I thought it was very funny. <laughs> Jack D, they'll never find the body. We found the body. <laughs> <laughs> I did too. I love that. <laughs> there were some quirky, funny moments in this that I really appreciated. <laughs> so, yeah. They'll never find the body. We, we found, found the, the body. body. <laughs> <laughs> I laughed out loud too. <laughs> that was great. Um, but, I kept trying to figure out. I was like, "Why wouldn't he burn the clothes?" There's a reason he didn't burn exactly. the clothes. Exactly. <laughs> and so, like, and then the, I, when it came to the end, yeah. I went, "Ah, oh, that's why he didn't burn the clothes." I had thought about but, that. I was like, "I was a like, maybe he did that," but then I forgot about it until the very end when I was like, he met the guy. I was like, "Oh, he killed this guy." But Sudra gave a a reasonable excuse early on about that mm. because when he was being questioned, Jaideep said, "I was afraid people could see the flames." Mm. I thought that was a lie. Well, it clearly was. Yeah. He he purposefully didn't burn them all the way through so they could mm -hmm. find the DNA on the clothes. Yeah. But his his reason behind why that was put out was I So that for me works. Sojo got me on that. I'm I'm sad that he never told us what he did with the body. <laughs> Cuz I want to like I want to know what you did, man. I know. Like did, did he breaking bad it? Did he like I know. <laughs> um I want I wanted to know. And then uh, there was a bunch of mathematics stuff that went <laughs> Me too. I was like, I'm assuming you're smart, yeah. so let's <laughs> We put algebra and geometry. <laughs> okay. I believe you. Wow. Wow. Ooh. I don't even know what that means. Deep stuff. But, but wow. <laughs> That's great. I have no idea what that means. Don't want to know. What is a geometry equation? Gives me anxiety. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's the difference? I don't it actually do I don't know. Um we're very dumb. It's very yeah. Um we, but yeah, the I, I enjoyed the entire thing. I really enjoyed all the performances, um, the direction of it. Um I enjoyed the score of it. The, the cinematography had a really nice feel to it. Sure did. Um, which I enjoyed. There was a actually a, a, quite a few shots in this that I was like, ooh, that's that's very pretty. Yeah. And as was Shout out as well to um, all of the, the prop and makeup and everything. And yeah, because all of the face smashing and the dead body exams That's and everything right. looked very believable. Uh, did you recognize the song she was dancing to? Yeah, the Helen song. I, the uh, minute they put the video up on the there. Blackface people in the cage. Yep. I immediately recognized <laughs> I like, it. I know that song. Yep. Uh, and I know there were probably a couple of other Easter eggs he put in there because I heard some background things going on on TVs and a few other stuff that we probably missed, but I did not well, miss Helen. Uh, and I also thought her daughter did a good job I as did well. Too. Uh, I did I too. I wanted to mention it because I thought she did a kid's... You 
never know sometimes. Sometimes they're they're not great. Um, yeah. The kid that he was a the student he was playing with a lot. I thought uh, I liked I did their too, relationship. Yeah. I liked their relationship um, as well. And yeah, there was just there was very little, uh, if any, that I didn't like about this film. Um, I think it's an enjoy. I think if you watch it, you're probably going to enjoy it. Yep. You might not like walk away being like, ah. Oh, the best film ever, but yeah. I don't think you're going to walk away not having a good time. No, I don't think, and I think that's the point of this thing. I think the point of this movie is to just, it's like a good book you read. Yeah. And you may not go read that book ever again, but you loved it and you'd recommend it. Absolutely. And it was very well put together. And this is, this is a very well, I, there's, I could think of a bunch of other films that would, would be say commercial successes yeah. that, I wouldn't want to give the time of day, yeah. whereas this one, I would really love to see a lot of people watch it because I think they would appreciate every level of it, most especially the acting. And for anybody that really, I can't imagine folks don't know how good of an actress Karina Kapoor is in terms of her being I a, imagine a, a we're just getting there and most people know. Yeah, but I, <laughs> I, I knew she was very good. For her to what I see is going, I really think... God granting long life and health and prosperity for her. I think she's going to start creating a filmography that's going to have the same type of critical acclaim and applause internationally as Taboo. Yeah. I, she's got that it factor. I think she might have already, like I said, I think... Many I'm, may already think she's better than Taboo. I'm talking my personal opinion. Well, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Um, I don't think anybody thinks she, I don't think anybody thinks most people are better than Taboo. Yeah, I don't know how you could... <laughs> Maybe um, e maybe equal, but that's 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 a little much for me. Yeah. But um, unless you're talking about Radica, because <laughs> <laughs> you know I love Radica. Um, I think we're just getting there in terms of knowing because we still have so much of her to see. I know, and I'm, I, I, I'm, I'm excited. We've been recommended too. a lot, of, sure. Like her, like thespianatic more style performances. Um, and so obviously, please let us know what her next. No, but we've heard so much, and they've had much bigger more broadly accepted films in the past couple of years for mm -hmm. us, since we're still babies at this, yeah. is in 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 the forefront of our attention because of the films they've released has been Alia yeah. and Topeka. Yeah, for sure. Um and Radhika and Not Kalki. Star, obviously. And yeah. you know, we could we we even even because of the series and a couple of other things, there were points where we've seen, you know, uh, uh, other people like Schwostika. But for me I would love to see her do a series. The the thoughts I had had predominantly because of music videos we'd seen and several of the films we had seen, my thought was of, like you said, more you even star. said, you think more of her as Pooh. Yeah, I do. And I did too until now. Okay. I, my thoughts are, that's what she did and was successful and beloved in that way. And she's a beautiful woman and she's got great quirkiness in her comedy. But if I go back and I find those nuggets of artistry that we've seen, Three Idiots, Omkara, Uda Punjab, yeah. to 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 uh, to Lash, to Lash yeah. um, and now this, and hearing that she said this is a new season for her where she's going to focus on artistry, not stardom, there isn't an actress I'm more excited to see what she's going to do next. Nobody that I'm uh, is Karina Kapoor. Well, a film she has coming up in the crew, so I'm guessing that's coming out next year. The cast alone is incredible. Yeah. Um, so anyway, so let us know what you thought about the film. Did you enjoy it? Did you not like it? What, obviously, if we had questions, please answer those in the comments below. What should be the next film for all these people, including our Bondu, Sujoy Go? Yes. Uh, that if uh, he has other films that we need to get to, please let us know what those are down below. Mm -hmm.